hi guys welcome back to shaman's kitchen happy saturday i am in the mood now for my gardening and i'm going with hobby to the store for some grocery shopping and i will be also looking for some plants that i still have to put down in my garden so wish me luck guys hopefully i get some we're still under lockdown or lockdown is extended until june 2nd so i was a um, little bit worried i might not get some of the plants that i usually plant so i'm gonna take the chance today and go to some, a few stores that i think may have um like cucumbers and things like that so i'm taking you guys along with me please come on down let's go for a drive and do some plant shopping as i go along i'll show you more and more of where i'm going so sit back relax and let's get on this plant hunting so guys the reason i'm excited about planting a garden is because in canada here we only have three months to the exact to plant and to reap so that's no time out of 12 months it's no time at all so when this time of the year comes along i'm very very excited because we usually start in canada putting our plants down like mid may to last week of of uh, may we start putting plants down like flowers and garden vegetables and we just have like june july and august for our plants to glow grow flourish and bear so we are very excited about that because we have more cold weather than hot weather so we have to make much and that's why i sound so excited and all my canadian friends can probably relate to that because when we get good sunshine we have we're very excited we don't get too much of it Hi guys, so we came to Costco to grab some stuff and we noticed that the greenhouse is open but there's a line up so we're lining up to go in. I'm so excited. Hopefully I get some plants here that I want and I can do some more gardening today. Costco and they they have a very small variety of vegetables it's pretty much more um, chives I see and a lot of tomatoes this year I didn't plan to put down a lot of tomatoes so I got two hanging baskets and some kale but I'm gonna be looking for other stuff as well so I'm down to the second stop now this is the four season Four Season um, Garden Center here at Albion and Steels. Yes, Albion and Steels. I think they have a bigger variety, so I'm gonna check that out and let you guys know.
excited because I got all the things that I was looking for and more so I didn't get to show you guys what I bought but as soon as I go home I will show you guys what we pick up today from this greenhouse and they had everything so if you're looking for plants if you're in the um, Albion and Steels area there is a greenhouse called the Four Seasons four season greenhouse and they have a lot of herbs uh, vegetables and um, even flowers and different plants I didn't buy much flowers but um, I always like to go for the vegetables and I know there's like a big rush even the cashier said yesterday they had like a crowded crowded place so everybody's trying to do an early pickup and I didn't want to wait longer maybe later I'm gonna pick up some more flowers but I can't wait to show you guys guys look at these beautiful trees I bought some thyme, some Coriolor bitter melon, some squash, I bought some um, aloe, and here I have uh, celery, parsley, tomato, um, what is this one, Swiss chard, and some hot pepper, and I have my kale here, and some of bitter melon, and look what my husband did, I love my flowers, how nice my flower looks. I am so excited about these beautiful flowers. While I'm cooking, um, while I'm going to plant the rest of the um, garden, my husband is going to make some shrimp curry. So he's in charge of this while I'm doing the rest of the gardening. What's going on here, guys? My husband has his tomato, pepper, okra, his shrimp, and his masala is cooking up nicely. It is smelling so nice in this backyard. Parmesan on the planting again. Wow, shrimp's curry is looking amazing and it smells so beautiful. The tomato is a frozen one, that's why they look like that. I have my okra and pepper, and hubby is doing an awesome job. I just want to show what I did today so I planted some more cilantro because the ones that I did from the head that I cut out from mine that I use I'm not sure if they're gonna grow so I did went out and buy some more I planted some peppers hot peppers here and um, I have some koi bhaji or malabar this is the same from yesterday some more pepper here and some squash last year i got some beautiful squash those who remember so this one side here is done and i started on the other side i'm going to show you guys over here i did some um kale and my husband already watered it i have here some 
I have some um, cucumbers over here. I have some Swiss chard here. And I have a whole bunch more left. I have these bitter melon. I have um, chow rai bhaji. I have some um, cherry tomato. And oh, we have some more um, Swiss chard. And then I have some more that I still have to get to. So my aloe vera. I have here some flat leaf parsley and some thyme that I'm gonna have to do tomorrow because it's already dark outside and I'm trying to um, trying to go have some dinner now but hope you guys like this um, video so guys that's it for the gardening today there's more to come hope you guys like this video if you do please give me a thumbs up until then I want to say stay blessed stay safe bye for now